While the rest of the industry has been asleep at the wheel in this category, here at Morimoto we've been hard at work developing an incredible successor to the popular Morimoto two-stroke 3.0 LED bulb. Introducing the Morimoto two-stroke 4.0 LED bulb. The 4.0 recreates the original beam pattern from your optics effectively by doing more with less. It'll put more light on the road for you as the driver while creating less glare for oncoming traffic compared to any other LED bulb on the market today. And while LED bulbs still are not DOT compliant for use on roads here in the USA, foreign market users and fog light installers can still enjoy the best of the best when it comes to LED bulb technology today. The Morimoto two-stroke 4.0. One of the key differences between the 4.0 and the Morimoto 3.0, and really any other LED bulb on the market, is that the performance will remain consistent from the moment that you pull out of the driveway until you park. Whether that's 15, 30, or 45 minutes later, these bulbs will remain just as intense. Now in the automotive industry, it doesn't matter what you're looking at, whether it's another LED bulb with tons of power and tons of luminosity, or a high performance LED pod for off-road. With high power becomes high heat, and that high heat reduces the amount of intensity over time. The two-stroke 4.0 actually employs a very unique drive rate logic in the LED driver that changes over time. And the LED drivers are programmed to start up at a conservative 18 watts, and then they actually ramp up in power over the first 15 minutes before stabilizing at 22 and a half watts. Another key feature of the Morimoto two-stroke 4.0 is the advanced aluminum nitride circuit board in the center, allowing the bulbs to produce an industry-leading 1.45 millimeter surface emission interval. And what that is, it means the amount of distance between the LED chips, making it the closest to an incandescent bulb ever on the market. For reference, the tungsten filament in a halogen bulb is 1.4 millimeters, and the previous record holder for an LED bulb was two millimeters, set by the outgoing two-stroke 3.0 bulb. Using the industry's first ceramic PCB, we've eliminated the need for the dielectric layer and separate thermal element, which in combination with the Osram Oslon HJL LED chips makes for unmatched performance in any reflector or projector based application. Now when it comes to focal length, each size in the two-stroke 4.0 lineup has been painstakingly optimized for proper output in its designated application. To ensure consistency, special tools were designed to quality control the accuracy of each bulb as it comes off the production line. Since no single standard exists, regardless of if you're installing these bulbs in a headlight or a fog light or your high beam, the two-stroke 4.0s are infinitely adjustable rotation-wise, allowing you to perfectly dial in the beam pattern so the LED chip sits perfectly at the three and nine o'clock position. Now on the previous gen 3.0 bulbs, the gears on the base were prone to slipping when you're locking it into your headlight, but the new system is actually immune to that. So in summary, setting up the alignment of your bulbs is now easier than ever. One of the other best and unique features about the two-stroke 4.0 is actually a continuation of a feature that was introduced and patented on the two-stroke 3.0 series. This system not only cools the bulb, but actually helps to heat up the inside of your headlight using a 12,000 RPM fan to bring in cool air from one side and blow hot air out on the other side. With even more static pressure than the previous version, the cooling system on the two-stroke 4.0 maximizes the longevity of the bulb while serving up a bad weather benefit. Now, when it comes to the H11 size in specific, in order to emulate the output characteristics of an H11 halogen bulb just right, we've integrated a special tension spring into the base of the bulb. And what this does is it pushes the LED chip down with five Newton meters of force, again, perfectly aligning that LED chip in the right position, exactly the same as you would find on an H11 halogen bulb and setting it just right for the best optical performance in the housing. Now, like I said, the H4 bulbs also have a special feature. This feature was actually introduced on the two-stroke 3.0, and we were also granted a patent on it too. And what it is is ultimately it's a shade cup that surrounds the LED chips with a built-in micro optical reflector. It enables their ability to illuminate the reflector surfaces above the bulb much more effectively. So in a typical H4 based application, only about 30% of the raw lumens are projected on the road as forward illumination. And with the special optic, about 40% of the lumens will be projected out onto the road. The region of the reflector directly above the bulb is responsible for a critical amount of light within the beam pattern, making this patented feature a serious performance advantage over other H4 LED bulbs on the market. And all of this adds up to a bulb that is simply designed to last, which is why, again, we back these bulbs with a full lifetime warranty. So if you guys are looking for the best and most badass LED bulb for your off-road rig or your fog lights or you live in another country, you've got to check out the new Morimoto two-stroke 4.0. Lots of cool features like the internal heating system, 
the super cool, super thin circuit board, white and yellow light output, and all this, again, backed with a lifetime warranty. Guys, the new two-stroke 4.0 is here, and it's gonna remain relevant for quite some time.